Hi, I'm Beth Hallmark, the Director of Career Development at UT School of Information. And I'm glad today to tell you more about careers in the field of Human Computer Interaction, or HCI as it is more commonly called. As technology use grows and new technologies are developed, it is becoming more and more important to ensure we're making systems and devices that real people can use, and that we're researching how technology changes and impacts humanity. HCI as a field encompasses a large number of areas, as any human interaction with technology can be part of this domain. And this means there are many opportunities. As a technology-related field, HCI is predicted to grow 11% between 2014 and 2024, faster than the average. So what are some of the job titles related to the HCI area of study? As you might have guessed, they are diverse and varied and include titles such as the following. Computer and Information Research Scientist, Occupational Health and Safety Specialist, Health and Safety Engineer, Industrial Engineer, Software Engineer, User Experience Researcher or Designer, Human Factors Engineer, and Engineering Psychologist. And that's just a sampling. Though the HCI field initially emerged around military technology, today human factors also impacts everything from transportation, architecture, environmental design, and consumer products to energy systems, medical devices, manufacturing, organizational design and management, farming, sports, and even education. Within this context, HCI professionals tend to work for the research and development industry, the military, the government, in consulting, or in academia. In other words, lots of different areas. To learn more about the field and see the most current research standards and trends, the Human Factors and Ergonomics Society is a good organization to check out. Founded in 1957, the Society states its role as encouraging education and training for those who conceive, design, develop, manufacture, test, manage, and participate in systems. If this is an area of interest to you, the Society is a good place to start to identify programs of interest. The skill sets needed to be successful in HCI are varied as well and include, for example, the following. Data analysis, experimentation, technical writing, critical thinking, creativity, attention to detail, and an interest and commitment to improving the well-being of people. HCI professionals need to be up to date on effective research methods and practices, and they must also be able to communicate their ideas in a compelling way to investors and colleagues. They explore fundamental issues in machine interaction and everything that goes along with it. They also need to suggest or advocate for changes to technologies when needed, so they need to be able to state their ideas clearly and to nearly any kind of audience. They frequently interview workers and users of technology, so interview experience or user testing experience knowledge is always useful. In this field, the level of education required is typically at least a master's degree though there are preferences for PhDs in this area. Psychology, computer science, engineering, information research, or a related technical or scientific field also are preferred subject matter areas. Internships and previous work experience are important to obtain a job as a paid HCI professional, as well as published work. As of May 2016, the median annual wage for HCI professionals was just over 100000 those working in information and research and development services tend to earn more on average, about over 120000 with those working in education earning the least on average at about 72000 A typical day in the life of an HCI professional can vary, though it usually follows standard business hours. The variability is found around deadlines, testing availability, and other similar time-based factors. Almost all types of HCI jobs involve working with people and having an innate understanding of technology's opportunities, risks, and challenges. In summary, if you are deeply interested in how people use technology and how technology can work best for humanity, human-computer interaction is an area to dive into.